right guys, it's Goat Cabbages and uh, today I'll be teaching you how to install uh, Daisy 1.7.4 single player. Um, this is the download page, it tells you everything. I'm going to be uh, linking it in the description below. So first you, okay, so step one, download Daisy. I already have Daisy. Um, Inside the Daisy folder, okay. So download that 1.4 MB. It's not really that big, so don't have to worry about the file size. It's pretty simple. You just have to replace some files. And yeah, and there's a. Uh, it's clean to the wire scans. Yeah, um, found nothing. No, 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 no detections at all. Like, not even any false positives. So, finish downloading. Um, open it. It's in a zip file. So, inside the Chernerus folder. Okay, so you're gonna open this and it will have uh, two folders, mission and add-ons, and uh, read me, so yeah, just credits and all that. Okay, first you're gonna have to go to your Arma 2 Operation Arrowhead in install files. So I got the Steam version, so I, for Steam, you just go into, you, you uh, right click. Go on to properties, uh, local files, then browse local files. Then you should just come up. Um, go into your at DayZ folder. It should be on the top. Okay, so in the folder add-ons, open it. Now go into the zip file that you just downloaded. Add-ons. Extract both of those to the add-ons folder that's in your install and click move and replace for both of them now that that just um, replaced your daisy files with the single player files so, and then um, now we have to install the missions so back to the first folder out of daisy folder um, now we're gonna have to look for the folder called missions just open that up now Go into the zip file and now and then into that mission file again. Extract both of those and just yeah, extract them into the folder. Now um, if if you're gonna launch it from Steam, you have to set some launch options. Set launch options, it's here. Uh, I'm gonna put the launch options in the description. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. Um, yeah. So after you've pasted that into the launch options, just click on play, and it will launch. launch in just wait for it for a bit. Yeah, this happens sometimes. After that. I'm gonna like when when this is done launching, I'll show you how to do this with a Daisy Commander. Not sure how to do it with a Play with Six launcher though. I don't use that. And the download page is on MPGH uh, multiplayer game hacking forums. It's not actually a hack; it's just a mod of a mod. And uh, in inside the in the single player, you can spawn yourself items, and vehicles, and all that. Oh, not sure what that is. So just when it opens, I'll show you how to do all this stuff. And it's legit. Because all these people have thanked the uh, approved by the oh bad yeah but it's approved so it's a safe file okay just wait for it to load
twenty. This doesn't usually happen. I'm sure. Now you just have to just close that. Okay, usually it, on the regular Daisy, you wouldn't be able to click on single player, but now if you, you've installed the thing, you can click on it. Um, just go into single player scenarios. Make sure you go on that, and then Daisy Chernerus single player. There's a night one and a day one, so I'll just use the day one. Uh, restart. I've been playing it before. Oh, resume, yeah. That's weird. Okay, so I'm just gonna use Daisy like, Commander to launch it. Usually works on here for me. Launch Daisy now. And make sure you launch it. You don't. Don't launch into a server straight away. Uh, open up Daisy Commander. Go into settings, the settings tab, and click on launch Daisy. Now make sure there's no additional launch parameters or anything. Just click that. Yeah. You can do windowed mode if you want. That's what I usually do. And uh, if you launch it from Daisy Commander, it automatically disables the the title screens and all that for you. So you don't have to wait through them. So some screenshots. Donator. I'll be back when it's done loading. Okay, so it's done loading. Um, yeah, just click on single player scenarios. Then choose Daisy Generous Night single player or Daisy Generous single player. I'm gonna do the regular one. Yeah, it works from Daisy Commander. Yes. Yeah, so Uh, I'll, I'll resume the video when it's done loading. Okay, so it's loading, it's done. Um, oh, yeah, just choose your. Uh, yeah, so choose your gender, I choose male. And it spawns you regularly, like normally, and um, it gives you a random pistol or sometimes a melee weapon. has some extra mods like uh, armor, electrical grid, and you can like, uh, yeah, flips, cars, and yeah, so I've spawned with a, what's laggy, 
Yeah, so I've spawned with a hatchet. You can't reload it for some reason though. Um, so it's pretty much Daisy. That single player. It has bots and stuff. As as it has AI instead of actual um, instead of actual players. There's either bandits or heroes only. There's no actual survivors. Uh, bandits just attack you on site, and heroes they're friendly. And you can spawn yourself stuff too, so uh, double tap zero, not on the numpad, just the regular number. And this menu comes up. Um, custom loadouts has a selection of loadouts you can choose. It has some guns that are in actual Daisy, like XMA, that's from the, I think it's one of the DLCs. Um, AS50. have to switch weapons once, switch back, reload, it should work for like regular, yeah, yeah. Um, some of the other stuff, you can change your player model, it takes a while to load the DayZ player models, but you can change your your player model to one of the armor 2 ones, so example Russian soldier, Russian Spetsnaz commander. So it's like changing your skin. Well, it's not supposed to do so. Wait, I'll try something else. Insurgents. Insurgent commander. There. I don't think you can wear backpacks with this guy. Maybe you could, but I'm not sure. I haven't tried yet. Uh, now, in spawn objects, well, you just have to wait for the thing to load. Oh, open. Yeah, just open it up again. Um, you wait for it to load. It takes about a minute or half a minute, and it'll, the proper names of the items will come up, and the categories will come. For example, skin side by is a uh, skilly suit. So we'll just wait for a bit and then the thing should come up. Okay, so yeah, it's downloading all the ammo, M240, LMG ammo, Winchester, M249. These are just the basic objects, like uh, cardboard. One, there's medical boxes with all the medical supplies. Uh, there's ghillie suits. Ghillie suit. Now, the weapons. Toolbox, these are the basic tools. Oh, yeah, so I think all of the weapons, including the rocket launcher. Um, if you want the ammo, you have to go back to objects and get the ammo from there. Yeah. Vehicles, pretty much all of them that you can s uh, the legal ones in Daisy, not the armor tools. Uh, animals, you can spawn, spawn a cow, a uh, boar, it's not working, um, okay so I'll spawn myself a, um, a DMR, DMR, now spawn some DMR ammo, Put a few of them down. Put a car out somewhere. Red hatchback, or car, or whatever. So all of the stuff is, yeah. 
Oh, what happened to the DMR? I don't know, it's, it's all buggy. Usually it works fine for me. Okay, whatever. Um, when, you, when you first spawn the car, it, it's like fully, fully broken. You need to repair it. Or you can just double tap zero again and the, oh, now finally the daisy models just come up. Okay, so I can set my model to, I think, what do you call it? Uh, just get out of this. This is weird. Get in the driver. Get out. Yes, yeah, so I've changed my player model to the female bandit skin. I think that guy's still there. I'm gonna shoot him. Headshots. Первый по своим бьешь. Первый по своим бьешь. Yeah, so. So if you want to spawn a car and get it working, just get in the thing as a driver. Double tap zero, and um, click, scroll down until you get to the six option. Click, and it'll fix your thing. And it works. And uh, yeah, you can teleport yourself around the map too. Um, Double tap zero again. Option eight opens your map. Now you just choose where you want to go. Uh, I go to Northwest Airfield. Just click once and it should teleport you there. Yeah, so. Enemy. Officers, grid zero, zero, six, one, three, five. Yeah, so you have some. Teammates over there. Shoot them. One. Three is dead. They don't attack you when you shoot teammates like regular armor too. One. Yeah, so there's some Two like is down. Bandit snipers over there with our uh, gillies. Yeah, it's just trying to shoot me. So they're all AI, they're all bots and stuff. There's another script on here, you can um, clean up the dead body, so, so I just killed him. Now if you want to reduce lag, just clean it up, they're all gone. You can still hear the noises though. Uh, yeah, fun cheats, it just has some weird stuff like rainbow farts. You can send extra reinforcements, zombie shields. If a zombie come near you, come, comes near you, they just die automatically. Um, play as a zombie, you can change your player model to a zombie. So I'll just go work off. Yeah, so I'm a zombie with a gun. Which is pretty cool. Some guys. Yeah, so that's pretty much... Daisy single player. Um, all the, the download, all the download links will be in the description below. Uh, leave a like, subscribe, comment for more tutorials and how to mod Daisy in Arma 2. Alright, see ya.